everyone, never mind what I look like. So I'm gonna do this part first. So basically this will hopefully be one video or I might combine it like over the Christmas break kind of thing. I just wanted to show you guys what I got my sister and my boyfriend for Christmas because I'm gonna wrap their stuff now. Um, and I'll also show you what I got for Christmas which will be in a couple days. So uh, I'm probably better off starting with Sprouts actually because hers is at the top. So I always buy her a calendar. So I got to choose this year. The other doll can I just pick for you? I do really need to get a desk calendar. So that might be a last minute order. But I went for the Wednesday calendar. She watched it as well. But I absolutely love it. It comes in like a little sleeve and stuff. So I thought that was quite good. And then I bought her this ages ago. But it's just a box. I got it from TK Maxx. It was only £8. Um, I think the calendar was only like £10 or something like that. Um, but I got this for her so that she can put like all her scrap memory stuff in from our travels and I quite like it because it's got the world map on it so I thought that was quite good and basically I said I will give this to her for Christmas she's probably totally forgot about this we got it in Switzerland back in uh April May and then she needed some new headphones so this was her main present till I bought her something else which was quite naughty but I couldn't resist um so I got her these got her some nice red ones she does normally go for gold, but gold is like really hard to come by at the moment. And then you would have seen this in like a vlog ages ago. I got her this like, ow, this mountain fleece from Nex. It's just like a half zip one. Um, and she tried that on already and she knows that she's getting it because I showed her it because I knew she would love it. And she was like, oh my God, can you get me it? But I said, oh, I'll get it for you as a present. So I got her that. And then... I got her two Victoria Secret crop tops. Um, or when I say crop tops, in they're sort of crop tops, but they come quite long on both of us, to be fair. They're the corset style ones that I've shown you again in another vlog. I actually showed you this one on. I got her sage. And then I got this, like, uh, what would you call that? Like a brown neutral colour, because I knew she would love that. And I thought the sage she would quite like as well. Why have I got my Santa hat in there? And then I got her some period underwear. And then, oh, I'll show you that one in a sec. And then I got her these um, in New York, just taxi PJ bottoms. I'm hoping they're gonna fit her. I never asked if her other ones fit her. And then basically, we like, we both like Selena Gomez, but Coach is Sprouts kind of bag brand and mine is Guess. I was just looking at it on, I think, Vinted and I saw they had a really nice, like, um, over the shoulder, like, you know, the ones, carry the ones that are in fashion now, a red one of the Selena Gomez, but it was like 115 pounds and I probably could have got her down a bit. But anyways, I then went on eBay because like, I didn't even think about looking on eBay and they actually had this one on Vinted as well. Um, but I picked up this one which I did actually say to Sprout, like I found something I want to get you, but you need to pick the colour. And if you do pick a colour, just know the different styles. Like that's all I can say. So she won't really have any clue that I've got her this. But I found it really weird because I was looking what to get her before. And then I think when we was in New York or when we was coming back, she was like, oh, I really wish I got something from one of the Selena Gomez like campaigns. And I'm like, that's so weird that I've been looking for you. So it's like the wallet one, brand new. Um, and it is smaller than expected, but yeah, it has like a little zip bit at the front and then card wallet in there. So I think that'd be quite good for her because then she won't necessarily have to use a card wallet and she uses a small little June one at the moment. So yeah, I feel like it'd be perfect for her. It comes with a long strap as well. It's got a bit in the back and yeah, I don't know how much it retailed for, but I managed to get it for a hundred pounds. So I feel like that's quite good. It probably seems quite pricey for you guys for a little, little bag, but coach obviously is expensive. And it's a Selena Gomez one. It has it when you open up. It has like her quote. I think it says not perfect, always me or something. But I know she's going to love that. And then I got her this really cute thing from Abbott Leon. Lion, however you say it. And I wanted to get a piece of jewellery. I feel like I get her jewellery every year. Yeah, I don't really want to show you guys because we've always kept Sprouts a real name a secret. Not that it's like a big deal. But it's basically our initials and it's combined into a necklace. And I just thought it was really cool. Let me kind of show you actually without giving away her initial because I don't know if she'd want me to anyway but like my N 
connect mine has like the gems on it but i thought she would love that like i know when she's wearing that it's like a little sister thing so that is all that i got sprout again that is probably quite a lot for some people moving on to bernard because i feel like this is quite good because just in case you guys want some ideas for the future or if there's an upcoming birthday I've got stuff. so i originally got bernard a nice jumper that he bought in an orange colour and I bought it in this like tearly blue that he really liked and he went and bought it yesterday so I literally had to go out today two days before Christmas and exchange it so I picked up these jeans from Marks and Spencers but I'm gonna have to exchange them again because I think he wants a waist up because the ones he's wearing today are a little bit snug and I think once we've washed them and stuff they're probably gonna shrink so yeah I'm probably gonna have to exchange them again and then he said yesterday he's like oh did you get me in any Tofifi and I'm like I think that's how you say it guys I've never had this brown before and I was like oh is that what they look like and I was like no anyways I was in home bargains today and they had them and they had white chocolate limited edition so I thought I'll just get them for him he can try them and then a really random purchase, I got him a thermal top from Primark. I just thought it might come in handy, especially like when he goes to Ireland and stuff. And if it's like winter, that will be quite good. And then I got him his aftershave that he wanted for a real good bargain, guys. The Boss, Hugo Boss in motion. I got it for like 30 quid instead of like 60 or whatever it is. And then when I bought him that other jumper, I did actually get him another one um, from Marks and Spencers. They're from. So it was this. And I'm hoping it fits because, again, otherwise I'm going to have to exchange it. So I got him like a half zip one, but I really love green on him. He loves green as well. That was £32, but I'm hoping it will fit because I basically just winged it like on the size and the fit just because obviously he's got one similar. And then I got him some like beard trimming scissors and stuff, like really minor. And then I got him just some like pants. And then what I did is look, I bought him a Gymshark tracksuit because he really liked the one that I had on when he saw it. And then I bought myself this like teal blue colour. So again, if you've seen it in another vlog, you've seen it before. And I basically bought him one as well. And he said when I was wearing it the first time, he said, like, oh, that's a nice trackie. I like that. So I was like, thank God, because I bought you it. So yeah, that is all that I got for them. Again, try not to go OTT. I don't really feel like I've done well for him, but, you know, I do go, like, all out on his birthday and things like that, and, you know, got to chill out now. That is everything I bought. I'm going to wrap them all up now. Ah, oh, let me show you the wrapping paper and bag that I've got. The sprouts. So I got this in Paper Chase last year when they were closing down. It's like a cat Christmas one, and then cat wrapping paper. But yes, I will speak to you guys probably, I'll probably vlog Christmas Day because it's just me and Bernard um, this year. We're just going to have it as just us. So we'll probably just vlog then and show you guys what I got. And then I realise I'm going to my mum's Boxing Day, so I'll get more presents then. So I'll have to show you guys on Boxing Day as well what I get from them. Hey everyone, okay, so it's Boxing Day today. I can't remember where I last got to in my last vlog, but I forgot that I was getting some extra birthday presents from Bernard's sisters. So I'll quickly show you what I got. Oh, and I'll show you Secret Santa afterwards. So basically I wanted a water flosser. So I asked for that. I think it was in the Black Friday sale. So I don't think it was super expensive. But yeah, I need to try it out. But I was kind of leaving it all in the box just so I should, could show you guys. Um, but one of my sister has this and she said it's really good. So I'm hoping I'll like it. Um, and then I got like this little glass photo frame. I feel like a Polaroid would go perfect in there. Um, so I need to... Pick a photo and print one out. That was Secret Santa, actually. No, it wasn't. That was my birthday. And then on my Secret Santa list, I thought I'd put some extra gifts because I wasn't sure who had got me. And I know last year they took some of the ideas from there. So I asked for another Jeffree Star liquid lipstick in Dead Presidents. And I basically use these as eyeliner. If you didn't know, I don't wear these colours on my lips. Um, but it's supposed to be like an olive, like khaki green. And I feel like I'll go perfect with obviously my olive stuff that I have that I wear a lot. For Secret Santa I got a candle which I will need to take downstairs and then I wanted some essential oils for my diffuser which I haven't used in a very long time just because I only have pina colada and two like sleep ones which actually I might put on later because I feel like I need a good sleep that's uninterrupted. So I got this like a uh, autumn harvest set and you get forest pine, vanilla, pumpkin spice, snickerdoodle, cinnamon and apple cider so i think we'll probably like all of these but yeah i will test them out and they kind of last a while anyway but i get a bit thingy because i know they say that they're apparently like not that good for cats so puts me off a little bit 
And then um, I asked for another Jeffree Star liquid lipstick. This one is in Healing Hour. And again, a colour I probably don't wear too often, but when I do, I'm like, it'll go perfect with it. Might make a bag for rubbish. And then from Bernard, I got a voucher, which was obviously emailed to me. And then I asked for like a light up mirror because I use like my handheld Grinch one when I go on holiday. And I saw like a rechargeable, I think it was by Conair in Ulta Beauty, but they were quite pricey and I didn't like, I was just in the queue and I was browsing. So I was like, I don't want to make a rash decision in case I don't like it. So I just got like a cheap rechargeable one on Amazon. And then, <laughs> Bernard hates me for this. Uh, there's a bit of a mix up, but I use this shampoo and conditioner. That's what I've been- It was a mix up guys <laughs> and um, it was a mix up shush <laughs> and yeah so I'm using this one at the moment I do really like this brand but sometimes I feel like when I've been using it for a long time I like to just switch it up because I feel like my hair gets used to it um, so yeah I got that which I do actually need the conditioner because I still got quite a lot of shampoo left and I've got no conditioner now but I really wanted to try this brand I've seen a lot of people raving about it uh, not so much the shampoo and conditioner but I think it was like I it was like hair oil or some sort of spray or something um, but the brand as a whole gets really good reviews. So I got shampoo and conditioner from Colour Wow. I always get a colour protection one because obviously I colour my hair and that's what you should use if you have coloured hair. And then obviously I've had a lot of trouble with my skin and I've been using the LMS Pro Collagen Cleansing Balm and that's been okay on my skin, touch wood. So um, I wanted a toner just so that when I get out after the shower I can do a toner. So I got the Soothing Apricot Toner and again, it had really good reviews. So hoping for the best. And then my mum basically got, I'll just show you quickly, the babies, two beds. So she got them like a, I can't, like a teddy material piggy on the outside. And then it's got this yarn scratching stuff on the inside. And then basically a redo of the one I've got in the bedroom, but this is baby pink. So these are just from Shein and my cats love these. I've got two in the bedroom and currently now two downstairs. Um, but yeah, they use them like every day, every night, they snooze in them. So yeah, can't go wrong. Then she also got them loads of treats and stuff. Right, so this next lot is literally all from Sprout. I can't show you guys this one really. Actually, you can see through. So, oh, hold on, hold on a second. My mum and dad basically got me loads of gift cards. I love a gift card. I know some people hate them because they just feel like it's a cop out, but I love one. So I've got quite a few there. And then it was basically the Peter Pan 70th anniversary. So I have quite a few Peter Pan things. First up is another lounge fly bag. I have so many of them. I have so many Peter Pan ones. Yeah, Alice in Wonderland is my favourite and I don't even have one bag from Alice in Wonderland. But I did get the matching purse for my birthday, if you remember. And then basically, I had a dressing gown that I absolutely loved. It was a small to medium and it has like my favourite quote on here from Alice in Wonderland. And yeah, it just was really tight. So I sold that on eBay and I'm pretty sure I gave my sister the money back for it because she did buy it and I just wanted her to rebuy it in a bigger size. Do -do -do. Super soft, Alice in Wonderland, classic Cheshire colours. It's got the little Cheshire hood. And then it's got Cheshire on the back and it says, we're all mad here. I will start wearing that. And I think that was in like a 2XL or something. Oh, I've got so much stuff. And then apparently I asked for this, which I don't remember. But, and I don't need any more blankets either. So I might have to go through and look to see what I can get rid of potentially. But it's a Disney cat one, obviously cats just love the cats and it has lucifer on which is very rare to get lucifer on some um it's got like kitty marie and that i think the only thing it doesn't have is the cheshire cat which is quite surprising so yeah got a blanket and then we got these in florida because obviously when i get to use my other pair they're probably gonna get trashed and i absolutely love these so yeah some grinch socks which you would have seen in my uh new york vlog and then you probably would have seen this as well but it kind of matches all my other bags. Well, I say all my other bags, pink and my green one that I have, but it's slightly bigger, non-glittered handle as well, like sequin handle. Absolutely love it. I need a red bag. Like I don't have a red bag. And then this is really minor, but my sister got me like a little, um, you know, nail buffing thing because I took all my gel nail polish off and it was a disaster. My mum got me a diffuser. I forgot I have some of her presents mixed in here. Got some eyelash curlers. A face mask which we got in New York in Ulta, another brand that I've never heard of but I just wanted to try it. Packaging drew me in, that was from Ulta. 
I love Freeman face masks, so Sprout got me a pack of them again from Ulta in New York. More gift cards, mum just did them in a different way. <laughs> and then I have this top as well, which is a bit, again a Christmas present, but you would have seen it in my New York vlog. Actually, no, I don't think that's gone live yet. But it's in my New, new York vlog. I gave it to Sprout to wear because she was dying for like a dressy sort of Christmassy sparkly top to wear from Monsoon in the sale. They don't have this colour no more, but they have like a healy colour. Another face mask, guys. And then I will change my case eventually, but I feel like I haven't had this one on for too long yet. It's just my Gus and Jack one. But Sprout got me a sunflower one. I also have a Peter Pan one on the way because Skinny Dip have not made Peter Pan ones yet. So I ordered that and then I do have a Lucifer one. So I can't order any more cases until I actually use these. And then my mum got me an A4 photo album because my dad keeps printing me pictures that are in A4 and I have nowhere to put them. So that's why I got that. We got some black Lululemon leggings, 25 inch, which I am in desperate need for. We don't pay full price, we get 15% off. So yeah, just them. And then Sprout got me some Lululemon leggings. I love this colour. I have a purple pair that I got in Vegas in 2017 that I love and live in all the time. Um, but I really like this colour. It matches a sports bra that I have. So Sprout got me them. Uh, they're 23 inch. Oh my goodness, guys, we're still going. A little reusable Grinch bag that I made my mum buy me when um, we was in Primark because then I can just shove it in my bag and I've always got a bag if I need one. And then in New York, we picked up these in TJ Maxx, Paris Hilton things, they match my perfumes. This was the OG perfume. This was the first, not the first perfume I ever got, but her first perfume I ever got. And then I picked these up with my mum. I can't remember if, oh, Madeline. I said I really like them or something. She's like, they're proper PJs. Now I'm not a fan of wearing white, but I quite like these. So it's just like a shirt style button up. Then you get some long bottoms and they're so soft. Guys, I promise this is ending. <laughs> so much stuff. And now we've got all sort of Peter Pan purchases. Oh, my sister got me like a cute cool pusher thing. And then my mum got me some Reed, not Reed, diffuser oil. Okay, so I have an Alice in Wonderland Scentsy. And then I saw they had a Peter Pan one. I was like, I need to have it. So I got some oh, wax melts. And then I got the Peter Pan so you can see what it looks like. I will eventually get it out one day and um, show you guys what it's like. I can't remember what this looks like, so I'm gonna open it on camera. These are from the Disney store. Apparently I asked for this, but again, don't remember. But I do need to sort out my cupboard here and like make use of some of this stuff. Oh, I remember this now. It's just like the scene, window scene. It basically matches the um, like the bag I got. Can't forget the chalky coins. And then I got a little wall clock, which I'm actually quite glad is small because I did think it was going to be quite big. So I need to sort it out and put it with my Alice in Wonderland one. So that'll be a task for over Christmas. And then I can show you guys that because I don't really want to get it out because it is fragile. And then a really random one in here. It's to go with my other solar lights because I got a little fruit collection out there. So I asked for my little pair to complete the collection because I've got an apple and strawberry, I think it is. And then I got some Alice in Wonderland plant pots, which I'll save. I'll probably put them in the garage and save them for when it's spring, summer, and I can get some plants and put them in and actually use them, because otherwise, what's the point in having them? So they look like this. Although, do I really want to put them outside and they look like that? And it looks like that. So yes, that is finally everything that i got i have been super spoiled by everyone so now i need to put everything away if you guys can see the mess right now look at that <laughs> so i'm going to tidy that up need to do some treadmill but yeah i'll see you guys in my next video i hope you guys enjoyed this one don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button and i'll see you guys in my next vlog bye guys